All right, today we're going to do another logic puzzle. This one's called Animal Lovers. So four kids went to a very unusual pet store and each child picked out a different animal to take home. Can you match the child with his or her new friend? So we have a unicorn, sea serpent, manatee, and dragon. And then the kids are Dan, Sarah, Melody, and Uli. So here we go. No child has a pet that starts with the same letter as his or her name. So Dan starts with a D. Which animal starts with a D? A dragon. So he does not have a dragon. Sarah starts with an S. Which one starts with an S? The sea serpent. So Sarah doesn't have the sea serpent. Melody starts with an M. Which one starts with an M? The manatee. And then that would leave Uli with a unicorn. All right, we're done with number one. Number two, Dan doesn't have a pet that lives in the water. He doesn't have a pet that lives in water. Do unicorns live in water? No. Sea serpent? Sea is a big body of water, so he can't have that. I'm not sure if you know this or not, but a manatee is something that also lives in water. So he can't have that. So what does that leave Dan with? A unicorn. Now, if you remember yesterday, if somebody has an animal, can the rest of them have it? No, nope. so we're gonna put X's there. All right, let's look at number three. Melody is allergic to smoke. Hmm, which animal would have smoke involved? A sea serpent, manatee, or dragons? Well, I know when I read fairy tale books, Typically, the dragons breathe fire, right? And that might leave some things burnt and smoky. So let's say she can't have the dragon. So what would Melody have? The sea serpent. So if she has a sea serpent, can Uli have one? No. All right. Sarah loves to fly. Which animal flies, a manatee or a dragon? Yeah, a dragon flies. So that's what Sarah wants. So we're gonna color it in. And so since Sarah has a dragon, she's not going to have a manatee. And if Sarah has a dragon, can anybody else have a dragon? No. So that only leaves left a manatee for Uli. All right, so on the back of your paper, you're going to be doing climbing ladder riddle called dressing up. All right, so you're going to be starting at the bottom where it says shirt, and you're going to end up with something else that would be a clothing item. All right, so the first clue says another word for soil. Take away the first two letters, then add one. So we're going to take away two letters. We will keep the IRT and put a new letter. Okay, the next clue says, to run somewhere quickly, the mouse made a blank for the hole. Change the vowel. Okay, so here in the second blank, we have a vowel, and you're going to change it. You know it has to be an A, E, I, O, or U. So you already used the I. You know you have to make it an A, E, O, or U. Okay, and then... Up here, it says a piece of something. Anne gave me blank of her cake. Change the first letter. So you're going to cover up your first letter, keep the last three, and put in a new one. Where And that word that you make should make sense in the blank. Anne gave me blank of her cake. All right. Then it says short, quick breaths. A dog began to blank as he chased the cat. Change the third letter. So this letter right here in the third blank, you're going to change that one. And the last part, another word for jeans. Add a letter to the end. So you're going to keep all four of these up here, and you need to add a letter at the end. All right, don't forget to put your name on your paper and turn it into the tray.